hello guys welcome once again this is tech pba thanks for joining me so in this video i'm going to take you through how to reduce or shrink large files and large folder sizes um, to smaller sizes to enable you to share those folders or those files over the internet through microsoft outlook or any other email application through file transfer website and then file transfer applications so let's get straight into it so on this um, pc um, windows pc i have this folder on the desktop when i open it um, i have these three files in there when i select them you can see the size of the three files the, you can also right click on them and then select properties and then you'll see the combined size of those three files 4.76 gig which is quite huge to share over the internet so you would need to reduce or shrink the sizes of these files to be able to send it over the internet so when i close the, fo the folder right click on the folder select properties that's another way to check the size of the contents of that folder so to begin with to shrink the size of this folder right click on the folder mouse over send to and then select compressed folder or compressed or zipped folder and then that would begin the compression or the reduction of the folder size to a much smaller size um, to enable you to um, share that smaller sized folder over the internet using either outlook or any file transfer website or file transfer application so you can see the process is just done and then when it's done you get the opportunity to rename the compressed um, folder so you can see the original file name is um, backup files so you can change this or keep the original file but in my case i will add compressed to this one so backup files compressed to differentiate it from the original one then when you right click on that and then you select properties you can see that from 4.7 gigs we've reduced this um, folder size to 460 megabytes this should be much easier to send over the internet than the original 4.7 gigs that we initially saw so yes that's the size of the new compressed folder um, again so if um, you send it to somebody and the person receives it all the person needs to do is to right click on it and then extract the contents of that um, compressed um, folder um, to the, um, the PC just as we are looking at right now so I I unzipped that uh, compressed folder and then the original size of the data or the original size of the folder has been restored so yes guys kindly click on the subscribe button down this video to support us to bring you more of such videos click the like button if this was helpful share the video turn on notifications for all and then I'll see you guys in another video thank you bye